Alex Caceres is slated to go down against Daniel the Pit Pineda and <coughs> Caceres is a heck of a technical fighter and a great knockout artist, 5 foot 9, 73.5 inches of reach. 20 wins, 13 losses, 1 no contest, so unpredictable fighter. He recently knocked out Julian Rosa, prior to lost to Sadiq Yusuf, defeated Sam Guachoy, Kevin Kroom, Austin Springer, Chase Hooper, Steven Peterson, and many other high-level opponents. This guy is a UFC veteran, and uh, he's a UFC member for like 12 years. What a great career. Daniel Pineda is a submission specialist. The pit, 5'7", 69 inches of reach. Black belt in BGG, 28 wins, 14 losses, 3 no contests. Pineda recently choked out Taki Lutz. 4 to no contest against Jeremy Kennedy, Mavlid Kaibulayev, and uh, also Andre Feely. As accidental eye poke and Pineda was uh, unable to continue. He knocked out Herbert Burns, but Cap Swanson knocked, knocked him out, so... I believe he's a no-distance fighter, and against Alex Caceres, Pineda gets the advantage if the fight gets direct to the ground. If Caceres keeps it standing, Caceres gonna piss him up. So, not much uh, of a philosophy here. The fight will not go the distance. If I must pick a side, I want Caceres to win, but this is 50-50, so let's say side call Caceres.